Hello everyone and welcome back to Pokemon Sword, the water type monolock where I beat Pokemon Sword in a Nuzlocke format with only water type Pokemons. As per usual, I'll show off my team at the beginning of the episode and hopefully none of them die. Acupuncture, the now Toxapex, forgot the name of the Pokemon, Fidel Gastro, the Gastrodon, Bubble 07, the Inteleon, the newest member are... Bold Gyarados Douchey Sushi, uh, who is doing very well for herself. Dr. Pelipper <laughs> and Araquaphobia. In this episode, we're going to be trying to get to the rock type gym leader in Gordy, who I have never even seen before, so this will actually be a new experience for me. And besides that, I think we actually have to watch an old lady touch the small boy with the broccoli hair. <laughs> Come to gawk at me now that I've had my challenge ban taken away and my gym challenge status revoked? Yes! Can you really afford to waste time like this? Of course! <laughs> well, I suppose so. You don't have to worry about catching up with me after all. I'll have you know, though, I haven't given up. I must become the champion in order to help out the chairman. I will go and ask him to let me rejoin the gym challenge. Or... That boy... Now that's what I call pink. He's big and all regally. Time for my gym mission, child. Mm. I love this part. It's so good. Pink and pink. Congratulations, child. I like Opal. She's, I like when they give them a little personality. Not many gym leaders in this game have it, but she's got it. She's got it. You should head to Sir Chester. I take it you know how to get to Route 7. That I indeed do. Definitely one of my favorite parts of the game. I wish they showed more of those two after this, but they really don't. They just kind of show the end result later towards the end of the game, but that's fine. Now, if we head over this way, I'm trying to think what we got to do next. Oh, um, shit. So, oh, okay. Now, I like Sonya, right? This is a talkie episode, by the way. This is a talkie episode. Like, I love Sonya. But this part of the game right here, kaboom, right? Okay, okay, okay. So you know how, like, in Gen 4, you went to the distortion world with, like, Cynthia and, like, how in, you know, Gen 2, Johto, you explore the Team Rocket base with Lance. And you know how, like, I don't know, in Gen 3 and Emerald, you, um... You know, you went to the, the space station to fight Team Magma with, with Steven. So, so what does this game do? All right. Oh, look, it's Leon. Maybe I'll get to go on a cool adventure with him now that I'm stronger. Oh, I'm looking forward to see. Oh, uh, oh, leave the investigation to the adults. <laughs> okay. Guess I'll go fuck myself. Get those gym badges. All right. Uh, it's fine. I don't want to have a good time. Oh, look, I get this thing instead. Oh, <laughs> don't, don't turn around. Don't acknowledge him. Oh, it's such a disappointing part. Oh, God, that was such a missed opportunity to, like, do raid battles with Leon. Depression. Depression. Not even hop. Depression. Just depression. But we do have to pay attention. We have a big battle coming up. I'm going to lead with acupuncture as per, uh, as per usual. For those who don't know, which is probably a good bit of you, I like the toxic spikes everything. Here we go. All right, Chris, you and I both know I've got to keep on trying different strategy if I'm gonna catch up to Lee, blah, 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 surpass them. That is the attitude to have, surpass them, not just to match them. Anyway, now we get the one good thing about Hop is his theme. All right, let's do it. All right, so we're just gonna get a layer of toxic spikes up. Don't really care. Probably has Horn Leech and Shadow Claw. Uh, toxic spikes. Let's see, Horn, ah, look at that. Speak of the devil. How much are we doing? 18? Okay. Ooh, and the Rocky Helmet. Oh, it's perfect. Okay, so the Rocky Helmet's gonna take away a little bit each time. We're gonna get some Toxic Spikes. Um... You know what? Let's get two Toxic Spikes. Let's play really lame. Confuse Ray. Okay, if we hit ourselves here, we'll just switch out. Well, either switch out or Venoshock. I'm not sure. dun 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 Toxic Spikes. <laughs> they really killed it with the music in this game. I probably mentioned that like 30 times already, but they really did. I feel like I could two-shot it with Dr. Pelipper. 
with wing attack. Once, once Dr. Pelipper, I don't know if he will learn it by level up, but Hurricane, if I can get Hurricane on this Pelipper that never misses in rain, which it summons every time it comes in, that's, uh, that's pretty good. Shadow Claw, so I was right on two of its moves. Let's see, critical hit? No, that didn't look like it. All right, let's get a wing attack. We need to start stacking up this toxic damage across his team. Oh, one shot, nice, nice. The way you battle, you know, it kind of reminds me of Lee. Oh, it was a critical hit. Nice. Bolton. Oh, shit. All right. Well, let's just say this is why we have a, uh, a Gastrodon. And I'll say right now, if there is one Pokemon on this team that I really, 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 really do not want to lose right now, it is Fidel Gastro. Because if he dies, then every time one of these fast electric types comes in, someone's going to have to take a hit. Like, Fidel Gastro is an extremely important player. You know what I found out the other day that I was, like, mind-boggled by? I was playing a Pokemon Fire Red, and after you catch or beat the Snorlaxes that are sleeping on the two routes, if you use the item finder, they left leftovers under them. I was like, are you kidding me? I've been playing this game without leftovers for, like, 20-something years, <laughs> and someone finally told me, oh yeah, there's leftovers under them after they're gone. I'm like, oh, okay. okay, okay, oh, guess I'll go fuck myself, I got just like, what? Uh, let's finish off this, uh, little body slam of our own. Or not, alright. Oh, I avoided the, I avoided the attack that has a high chance to get a critical hit, okay. Oh, my bright powder! Oh my god, I didn't even realize that. My bright powder, my item came into play. Uh, Aqua Tail. There we go, and that should be a kill. Yeah, good job, Bushi Sushi. Hop is the first. I'm kicking his team's ass, and he will be sad again. Ha ha. <clears throat> and Aqua Tail from Gyarados should be it. Oh, and Poison's gonna take care of it. Easy. Easy, that's literally right there. That was the minus attack nature coming into play. What the hell? What the hell? How is Gyarados gonna... God damn it. What a brave soldier she is. Nothing but respect for her. This is rubbish. My team can't perform. Okay, easy peasy. Alright. Let's do... Oh, shit! Okay. Hi, how are you? This thing is so... It is just Unovian Persian. And nobody ever talks about it. It's literally just Unovian Persian. Buffalon is Unovian uh, Tauros. Beartic is Unovian Ursarim. God damn it, Gen. I, I love Gen 5, though. Hydreigon, or Hydreigon, or whatever you want to call him. That's my boy. That's my boy right there. Durant, that's a real man right there. Gen 5's got good ones. And Embor. I don't like- <gasps> Oh! That's a good move. That's a good move. Dragon Dance. Okay, well, uh, we officially win, so. <laughs> we can actually make up for the not good attack. Yes, Dushi Sushi is slowly getting it together. All I really want is maybe Earthquake, Waterfall, Dragon Dance, and then a move of my choice, whether it be Ice Fang, Power Whip, something. Oh, this is going to be such a good place to level up our guys because of the girl g Gollets. Speaking of Gen 5 good Pokemon, Gala! Gala! Let's... I know I'm not going to kill in one hit, so I'm going to Dragon Dance. We're actually going to use our new move. Love the animation on that. My compliments to the chef for that one. Magical Leaf never misses. Going to do nothing. Alright, uh, I think a Dragon Dance boosted Aqua Tail with Stab is going to do a lot. I don't think it's going to kill... Oh, it might kill. Oh, no, okay, it'll kill. <laughs> now, always under... See, I, I underestimate my Gyarados in particular because she's bold. She's bold. That, that just means she has a big heart, though. See, now... Like, right now, I'm not too worried about anybody dying. I'm just really curious about which of these six are going to make it to the end. Because I feel like at least one of them should, right? Because come, like towards the end of the game where a lot of the enemies actually get a little harder with this rule set that I'm doing, I could definitely see some uh, some death and destruction. Oh, there's Girder here. 
Oh, you know, y'all are about to call me a fat nerd right now, but I am literally considering EV training my Gyarados in attack. I'm considering it. I'm not saying I'm going to do it. I'm considering just beating up nothing but girders for five years. Smart strike. That could be useful. All right, so while I'm running through this place, I guess we could have like a little fun time talk together like we do sometimes. I just missed an item, God damn it. Um, so I was talking to my friend who, she used to play Pokemon when she was younger. She played Gen 1 through 3, and then she dropped the series until recently where she played it in Gen 8. And she's been going back and playing all the old games. So she just recently played Gen 4, my favorite. She's like, oh, that was pretty good. And she played Gen 5, and she just ordered a 3DS online with X and Y and Oris on it. And I was telling her, I was like, oh, you're gonna love that game. That's, uh, you're, um, what's it called? I was like, and she was telling me she was gonna pick Trico in Oris. And I was like, oh, that's my favorite. He has like such a cool mega evolution. And then she was like, what's mega evolution? And I just like completely, I was like, I was in disbelief, right? <laughs> because it's like, there are actually people out there who only know Dynamax. They don't know what Mega Evolution is. And I had to explain to her what Mega Evolution was. And then, and then I was mentioning like, oh man, Sun and Moon's pretty cool. It has like Z moves. And she's like, what's Z moves? And I'm like, what the fuck? It's like, it's like, oh my, it's, you know what I'm saying? It's so weird. It's so weird. How like, if you just skip out on one or two games, you completely miss everything. It's so weird to me. I don't know, it's just a random story I felt like sharing. It was, it was, it was insanity. I was so, I was like, whoa. <laughs> I did not think the human being like that existed, but they did. Uh, over here is an item. Terrain extender, not really useful for me, but that's fine. And I believe that route is done with already, which means we're already at Surchester, question mark? Not yet, we have, oh wait, no, it's right there, fuck me. <laughs> okay, um, let's see. I love this town. This is also where Snom is. Where's Snom? Snom! Come out. Come out. Ice Pokemon are precious. Come on. Come on. Okay, he's walking back. Fuck him. <laughs> Arcanine. Are we gonna double intimidate each other? Yes, we are. Okay. Uh, let's be careful though. This thing knows Thunderfang most likely or Wild Charge, uh, both of which will kill me despite Intimidate because it's times four. Um, and by the off chance it does know those, we're gonna do this. And would you, look at that hard ass read right there. Oh shit! My third eye, Gastrodon, his third eye it gave me strength. Earth power this doggy, please. Fire Fang. Okay, don't burn or flinch. Don't burn or flinch. Don't burn or flinch. Don't burn or flinch, please. Thank you. Fennel Gastro is definitely MVP for the day. And here we are. I love this little town. It's so nice. Look at it. Oh, it's so peaceful. And I'm actually glad we got here now. Because part of this challenge is I don't... Now, I didn't give myself a strict limit, but I don't want to over-level too much. And my Pokemon are exactly the same level as Gordy's highest, from what I'm told. I was told it was 42 or 43. So, this works out perfectly. Which means I'll only be, like, level 43, 44 after doing some of the gym trainers, I'm assuming. So, this is just perfect for me. There's a TM over here. Yes, there is. What is it? Icicle Spear? That's not going to do anything for me right now, but I will definitely remember that that exists in my inventory. There it is. Yeah, we just go to the gym. Okay. Arg, I lost and it all went to shit! <laughs> there must have been something wrong with my strategy. Yeah, Rock Zoom Leaders, blah blah blah, Gordy. I'm actually very excited to see Gordy. I know nothing about Gordy. And me, I gotta figure out what to do from Team Once Roll. No more of this doubting. I just wish they just decided to animate his face. That's all he just smiles all the time. It's so hard. I don't get it. I don't know. I, 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 <laughs> who cares? How do you change? 
Wait a minute, we'll figure this out. We'll fig I gotta change the water type outfit. I'll figure it out. You wait. The Pokemon Sword and Shield seems to imply that you can change your gym uniform by giving you the ability to buy and obtain uniforms. You just can't. You can't change your uniform. Well. Well, that is all I'll say. <laughs> that is all I'll give that. Get my fancy little metal detector thing. Oh, do you want to hear the saddest story while we're waiting for this to start? Wait, what's this? Simple, invisible pitfalls. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. So the saddest story I've ever heard. There was a guy on the beach with a um, metal detector. What? There's a guy on the beach with a metal detector. And... What's it called? He, he went searching for this object for like three hours. And... So he went searching for this object for three hours. I'm sorry, I'm concentrating and doing this at the same time. He went searching for this object for three hours, and it wasn't even an object, it was his metal-toed boots. So his metal detector was detecting his boots that were right next, like behind the machine. And he went walking in a circle for three hours and digging holes for three hours, and he found nothing, and it's the most depressing story I've ever heard in my life. That's it, that's like, that's the story, but I just was like, holy crap, that's so sad. Aqua Tail, please. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, Bright Powder. Let's go. Bright Powder luck out in here. What? Damn. You'll love to see it. You'll love to see it. I don't know if I should keep Gyarados out. That's how she dies if I keep her out too long. All right. Abigail, that's a cute little uniform. I like that. Okay. Okay. Go. Just do it. Do it. Okay. Uh, we have Bubble 07 out. Let's get Bubble 07 back. Come here. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> I, just choked, I just choked on my saliva. Okay. Come on up, Bubble 07. Oh, I love the smug look. Whoa. I like Gordy's trainers. They're all smug as shit. Personality. You'll love to see it. Snipe shot, please. And snipe a shot. -a. Easy. This is why we don't send him out. We're restraining his power that will only be used to save mankind. Okay, just walk straight forward. Are you fucking kidding me? God damn. Okay. Go. The oh my god. It's testing my patience. Just Come on. It can't be that difficult. You know, if anyone could absolutely destroy every single gym trainer in here before the main challenge, I'm glad it's you, Bubble 07. Just absolutely killing it right now. Oh my sweet Jesus! Okay. Cool! 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 Great! Awesome! <laughs> Bye, Wendy! You have great fries. Awesome! Awesome, 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 awesome. Just gonna quickly just, just, just gonna, wow. <laughs> wow. She said, <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Wow, thank god I, oh, oh, my, the, the amount of things I could have done that I didn't do. I am so happy. Acupuncture? Let's just, let, that never even happened. Never even happened. It's okay. I would have cried. <laughs> I like him. I know he doesn't get too much sunshine, but I like him. He's just like a good dude. He's just like the guy that's there. He helps when you call him. He's the quiet kid in the back of the class. He knows the answers and the teacher calls on him. You know, he's a good guy. That is another gym challenge done. You did wonderfully. Just wonderfully. All that's left now. Let's make sure we're set. Okay. Everyone's good. You okay, Bubble 07? He looks, he, he looks tired, you know, but I know inside he was very scared and, you know, I was scared for him and I like him a lot. Please, I, I don't want to lose you. I, I really want to keep my starter. Pokemon game's not the same without your starter. Thank God Sudowoodo isn't grass type. If that was stabbed, that probably would have killed. All right, this is, oh, this is a cool looking stadium. All right, I've never seen Gordy. This is first impression time. Let's see what Gordy's like. Ooh, banana hair. Okay. I mean, I know what he looks like, but let's... 
Hey there, the name's Gordy. I admit I feel a little bad for doing this to a gym challenger, but I'm going to use this match to show the crowd that my Pokemon are unbeatable. So let's get with this challenger. I like the cockiness. He seems like a chill dude I would play Lego Indiana Jones with. Why Lego Indiana Jones? I don't know. I just get that feeling from- Also, whoa! Look at the little pose! My man with the JoJo pose, okay. Alright, Toxic Spikes as per usual. Shell Smash, we're killing it now. We're killing it now. Alright. This is actually horrible. Oh my god. Okay, this is horrible. I'm about to get sweeped by a barbacle. Alright, 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 alright. Do not be scared. His defenses are down, so we have to liquidation here. I might have to Dynamax early. Fuck. Razor shell, that's gonna sting. I do resist. Okay, okay. Don't defense drop. Rocky helmet. Alright, alright. Liquidation is gonna be very helpful. No defense drop for me. I think I recover stall with Rocky helmet. Yeah, that's what we do. We recover stall until we're confident here. Razor shell is terrifying. Rocky helmet. Recovery. Alright, one more recovery should be fine. Alright, don't drop anything. There it is. Fuck, that's what I'm scared of. I still live one more turn. Alright, we recover. We will live one plus three attack. That is insane. Uh, we just need to... This is guaranteed hit. Okay, liquidation. Razor Shell, don't crit. Please don't crit. Please don't crit. Oh my god. Alright, alright. Two defense drops. We gotta get out of here. Alright, wow, this is R. This is this. I like this! <laughs> I like this. Finally, a worthy opponent! Alright, acupuncture levels up. Shuckle. Actually, this is the perfect time to switch out. He's not gonna get poisoned. There, he's gonna get poisoned. Alright, Pokemon. We are 1000% going to send out Fidel. He's definitely been doing a good job today. I have a feeling. Let's see what he's got. Rock Tomb, that's fine. Absolutely nothing. But speed, unfortunately. But I'm a slug. I'm not really concerned. If it had sturdy, it's gone. Which is great. Uh, Earth power should kill this. No, it's bug. Fuck me. What is that? Why did special defense go up? Huh? 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 Okay. Why did okay, but special defense went up no matter what, so I have to remember that. Water pulse. Why did special defense? I'm so confused. Anyway, water pulse. That's fine. Confusion maybe. No. Okay, but this thing can't kill me. Rock tomb. This is perfectly fine. This is literally the best outcome right now. The only unfortunate thing is that I'm minus whatever speed and minus one special attack. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to... I don't want to switch out the bubble of 7. He's not going to be able to take any hits here. That's the one problem. If you want to do bubble of 7, you have to either switch into him after a death or something because he takes too much damage. I don't want you to take a rock. Mm, you know what? We just stay in for now. We're going to have to stay in and whatever he sends out we'll work with accordingly. Alright. Water Pulse... Alright, that's two. Okay. We got this. We got this. This is going a lot better. The barbacle was the, the, the main challenge so far. Everyone's leveling up. You love to see it. Stone Journer. Okay, this literal stupid thing. Alright, um, it's just pure rock type, if I remember. It's poisoned. I don't think it has any moves that I should be worried about. 
Um, and I really have nothing to switch out into. It's really up to Fidel Gasher right now. And he is minus special attack. Earth power it. Wonder Room, that is where the effects of items... No, special defense and... Okay. Oh wow, I was actually smart. I was actually so smart. He took his... Oh my god, wow. Okay, Gordy is a trainer. Gordy is a trainer. Because if I remember correctly, this thing's defense is way higher, so it, gave, it switched it with special defense against a special attacker. Body slam. If I get paralyzed, Fidel Gaster is done for the match. There it is. Okay, I'm not... This is bad. This is really bad. My speed is basically below negative at this point. I've lost a, a slight chunk of health. And he gets one more turn off on me here. Because I'm that slow. Stealth Rock? Oh my god. Alright. Alright, this is really bad. This is the worst. Alright, now I actually... Okay, I have to make a big consideration here. Alright, this is definitely Fidel Gatcher's episode. Uh, not yet. I'm not crumbling to dust just yet. We can still battle. Alright, 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 alright. Colossal. I'm figuring as much. This thing... is a menace. Um... Rock type will set up Sandstorm. I can counter that with. Di okay. It's going to Dynamax. Acupuncture's done. Easy. Bubble 07 can't take the, the Rock type move plus Sandstorm damage. You die to Rock type. You die to Rock type. You die to Rock type. Wow. My entire team is hoping to live due to a paralyzed minus one special attack Gastrodon. Alright. Uh, let's do Max Geyser. Like a giant mountain boulder. Hiya! Hiya! Ooh, look at him. Ooh, he pushed in the glasses. I like. He's got some style. I like this guy. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. This is definitely the most unfortunate situation I've had in terms of Dynamaxing. And if this does not show how, why I value Fidel Gastro as much as I do, this is why. He is quite literally one of the most important pieces to this team. Size means strength. Savor this pain. Okay. With pleasure. G-Max Vakal. Alright, now what is all oh, what does his ability do? Not a lot of damage. It's going to set up an unfortunate sandstorm, though, right? Oh, okay. Just, it just put up more stealth rocks. Oh, but no, that's even more. Okay, so now if I switch out, I get damaged by stealth rocks and those, if I remember correctly. That's going to activate Steam Engine, but he is already way too fast. Or I'm way too slow compared. Yeah, so this doesn't bother me. Yeah, it's plus. It's, uh, what? What is that? three times speed or whatever, 2.5 times speed, something like that. Oh, the rocks dig into you at the end of each turn, okay. There's his poison. Um, really, it's just a matter of hitting the Max Geyser. So he's just gonna do that again. If this, I, I just have to stall out. I just have to stall out a little longer. Paralyzed, I can't move, that's fine. There's the rocks. Fidel Gasher is doing fine. We take one more turn of that. We will live even a critical hit. Uh, defenses are back to normal, so he should really be dead. Max Flare, that is half damage, heavily resisted, doing nothing. And the Sun, that was very clever. Alright. Max Geyser, return. Is it enough? That is absolutely enough. Another gym battle down. No deaths still. D the team is together. They are not faltering. We almost died twice today. <laughs> but I can handle it with the utmost amount of professionalism. Because we're just that good.
All right, level 44. Definitely Fidel Gastro episode. Easily. The slug. It's the slug. He's too powerful. Let's go slug. Ooh, look at him smiling. I just want to climb into a hole. Well, I guess it more be like falling from here. Okay. Talk shit, fall into a hole. That was impressive. Rules are rules. Here, take this. The rock badge. Remember when the badges had names? Like boulder badge and shit? And rainbow badge? I'm, I don't know. I'm just remembering. Pokemon up to level 50. Oh, don't worry about me. I just need to train harder. That's all. I respect the hustle. That's it. Take this team. Rock Tomb? Rock Tomb. It's always Rock Tomb with these guys. All right. All right. That was good. And here's a special uniform that I can't wear. Stupid. The Rock Badge. Okay. That's it. That is another episode down. I'm getting nervous by how well we're doing. No one's dying. Everyone's alive. Everyone is doing perfectly fine. We're at the point where we're slightly overleveled, so I'm, I can't really train any new members like Dushi Sushi. They're just kind of catching up. But wow, like, I mean, good on it. Everyone did something, you know? So I'm fine. Really, the only two that didn't get too much spotlight were the original trio here. And even then, they they, they, they know they're respected. Especially uh, Bubble said He took a fucking wood hammer. Good boy. <laughs> but, yeah, I'll see you guys next time where we fight the Dark-type gym. We only have two left. And then the champion. So we're very, very, very close. I hope you're looking forward to joining me for the rest. Goodbye, everyone. And I will see you... Next time.